Hi guys, how you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome back to my channel. I have some news. Yes, I do. I have some really good news. Uh, first, I want to apologise about the other video. I am going to take it down because it was. Let's just put it this way: it was rubbish. So, uh, my last video. If you've watched it, you might have to watch it again because I'm about to take it down and. Re probably redo it in the future or just redo it gen like generally redo it uh, but yeah I have some really good news <laughs> um, who remember well you probably do because it's not that many videos back let's just put it this way um, back in September I had an assessment at the RNIB college in Loughborough we are finally we are finally progressing really good like after the assessment it felt like it it had all ground to halt we couldn't get in contact with our social services their transitions team who are funding the well who are, yeah who are funding the money for the course well it's not really a course it's more like a program it's the bridge program and they finally you know it was getting towards the date of having to know and I was like, I, I emailed them and said, well, I emailed Loughborough and said, look, I'm really worried. Have you had any contact? Blah, blah, blah. She said no. Um, and then she finally came back and said they have agreed to give you the funding. I was just like so excited. I didn't know how to react at first. I was like, uh, okay, yay. Uh, she was like, um, she'll be in contact with you in the next, you know, pretty soon. It got to last Wednesday and we'd heard nothing. Was it Wednesday? No. Yeah, it was Wednesday. It got to Wednesday and I'd heard nothing. So I emailed Loughborough again and said, look, I know it's only been a couple of days, but I haven't heard anything. Just thought I'd let you know. Thursday, she came back and said, okay, I'll give her a nudge. Uh, if we haven't heard anything by tomorrow lunchtime, you know, I go on half terms, I'm not here next week, so we'll just have to wait. Uh, I was in Northampton on Thursday, and I got back from Northampton, and we had a phone call from our, from my social worker, who I know nothing about, I only know her name, and I haven't met her in person. And she said the only we, you know, we, I'm ringing to confirm blah, 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 have you heard about uh, personal contributions? I said no. And the reason that what we were waiting for was for me to confirm that I'm happy with personal contributions. Which, to be honest, is not really, it is a sacrifice that I'm willing to make because I don't spend a lot and when I do spend money it's on other people or it's online or it's bath and body stuff or it's clothes that I need or you know I don't really spend a lot of money at the minute so it's a sacrifice that I can make so I said yes I'm fine with that you know she said okay we got to do a financial assessment blah 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 that hasn't happened yet and I'm not sure when it's happening um, yesterday was when things were being organised and I said the proposed date was actually the 21st of October which is a week on Sunday because of the delay in our social services that has now had to be changed which when I first saw it I was a little bit bummed and you know I was a bit oh, Okay, I've got to wait. The new date and the new confirmed date by everyone is the 4th of November. So it's three weeks away. It's a little bit like, oh, can't it be like a week sooner or, you know. Yeah, because they're going on half term and because of our delay, they can't provide, they can't put the support in place as soon as the 21st which is fair enough you know they've just gone on half term so can't expect you to do it within a day 
well, not even a day, it was more like a few, it was more like an hour or two hours. You can't expect them to be like, yep, yep, she can go in, blah, 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 flat with these people, yep, I'll look after her, yep, I'll be a personal tutor. You know, you can't do that all in like two or three hours. It has to be done over time. So, although yesterday I was a little bit bummed, now today, well, last night and more of today, I've been thinking, you know what, I'm going. You know, I'm still going, so I'm... I feel a bit better about it now. I, I'm i just impatient. I think that's what it is. I think that's why I was feeling so bummed. I was just, you know, impatient. And I still am impatient. But I just want to go. I just want to go and get it started. I want to learn to live independently. So, you know, it's, it's happening. And that's the important thing. But, yeah. I just... The 4th of November, 4pm, I'm going to be in, well, hopefully I'm going to be in love for, um, but yeah, uh, so she's, when they come back from half term, she's going to send me a welcome pack, and I think it's all the details of stuff that we have to bring, um, you know, and details of the day to day life, and other stuff, so, I'm so excited you guys are gonna wait. I'm so excited. Um but yeah, I just thought I'd do a well, a quickish video to let you know the progress and to give you the news to say that it's happening and I'm going. So yeah, I hope you like this video. Make sure if you're new to subscribe it would mean a lot. Thank you. Um don't forget to like and comment on the video. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.